When did we forget how to have fun? When did we forget to celebrate the wins? When did we plan or set up a goal for ourselves with actions and steps on how to get there, but celebrate each and every milestone? When did we forget how to do that? Because we have, we've forgotten, we've forgotten how to celebrate each and every win. In fact, we give ourselves such a hard time over so many things these days that we forget to celebrate the wins. A child, when they first learn how to walk, what do parents do? They get behind the child and they rear them and encourage them and they say, come on, you can do it. Come on, come on, just take that first step. You'll be fine, come on. And they cheer and they clap. They don't turn around to the child the moment that the child falls over and say, hey, listen, that was crap. You're not good at this thing called walking. That was crap. Could you imagine a parent saying that to a child that's learning how to walk? We would never do that. So why do we give ourselves such a hard time when we don't get to the goal faster? It's not a competition. Enjoy the ride. Enjoy the fun in getting there. Doing personal development and transformations and all these sorts of things, they're fun. They're not hard. You know, instead of thinking about weight, reword that. Talk about wellness. Talk about internal wellness. Even the word itself sounds so much healthier than weight. We talk about losing weight. We don't talk about shedding weight. Why do we talk about losing weight? What have we lost? We haven't lost anything. We've shed something. We've made a conscious decision to shed something. But equally, someone who isn't a, a size 8 or a size 10 can still be beautiful, can still be confident. It's just the way they carry themselves that makes a difference. It's time we change the talk. It's, it's time we celebrate the wins. It's time we help the young people around us in our society. It's time we help them feel okay about themselves. It's time we give them permission to be okay being them. It's that time. It really is. Because there's enough around the world. There's enough hurt. There's enough mental health issues. There's enough stuff. We need to create a wellness society. We need to create support for one another. I know it's behind a screen at the moment, but that's okay. But we need to create wellness.